Appalachian Wireless proudly brings you unlimited data. Unlimited data is only $80 a month for a single line. Four lines as low as $200. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. An East Kentucky network company. Data speed slow to 25 gigabytes per line to 512 kilobits for phones and tablets and 15 gigabytes for motors. See store for more details. In the three years that Stuart Bear Halbert has been Floyd County Jailer, he and his staff have charged 188 inmates with 220 counts of contraband. There were only 118 counts in the previous eight years combined. We've actually charged everybody. We don't, you know, we don't show any kind of favoritism or whatever. If you bring contraband into this jail, you will be charged. I've got a lieutenant, uh, Parker Drossett, that does most of the, the work on that and I uh, want to give him some credit. He, he only does a, does a pretty good job at it. When they come in on drug charges, we automatically go ahead and um, do a strip search. If we still think there's something that's possibly there, that's when we call the nurse, get a hold of the jailer, we get an x-ray. You'd be surprised what people can hide when they're really determined. Uh, for example, here's a needle that uh, was found in a cavity. And we got one really good one right here. This is a uh, cell phone that was in an anal cavity. Jailer Halbert says the facility will soon be getting a full body scanner to help them find even more contraband. This unit is something similar to what you have in airports. Um, it does pick up the stomach and, and the pelvic area, which actually takes two x-rays in one uh, because not only can they have it in a body cavity, but they actually do swallow this stuff too. Well, hopefully within the next two months, we, we should have this, this unit installed and actually going. It takes a collaborative relationship between the jail and other law enforcement agencies to try and combat the contraband issue, a relationship that's mutually beneficial. It's not only contraband, you know, working together with the jail, they get tips and they hear stuff that we don't hear out on the streets and it leads to bigger busts and also we might hear stuff that stuff's going on here and we, we tell them, you know, we kind of work together and help trying to keep this community and the jail as safe as possible to get the contraband out. Promoting contraband is a Class D felony, punishable by up to five years in prison. Reporting from Prestonsburg, I'm Sean Allen for EKB News.